Hey beauties, thank you guys for joining me again. Today I am just going to show you this style, this hairstyle that I have been rocking for the last few weeks. Um, this video is for the person that, or the girl that is actually transitioning from um, relaxed state of hair to the natural state of hair. Um, I'm kind of going through that little phase right now. Um, the reason why I have been going through this stage right now is because I haven't gotten a relaxer in about five, six weeks now. Anyway, um, I just wanted to share with you guys some of um, the little techniques that I've been doing to get this natural look. Um, to get yourself kind of prepared for what your natural hair will look like, you know, while you're growing it out, before you do the big chop, things of that nature. So if you're like me, I have like just a little bit of um, perm still left on my hair, or relaxer. I should say perm, because only certain people know what perms are. Relaxer is the correct term for it. Um, I have a little bit of relaxer still on my hair from just the last few, last, since the last time that I relaxed it. Um, Disclaimer, I am going to get my relaxer again. I just didn't, um, I just hadn't had it done because um, I was on vacation and I was doing a lot of beaching, a lot of pool, a lot of water sports and things like that. So the relaxer really just didn't go with um, what I was going with at the time. But what ended up happening was I just really cut my hair off all the way, pretty much around the sides here. And you'll see in a second what I'm talking about. Um, and like at the top, I just kept it low, but you can still see where I have the new growth and then the perm. So it's kind of at one of those states. And that's fine with me because I found a way to actually be able to like that it is natural when it's in, in actuality, it's really not. I recently was at um, the Essence Festival and you go there, you go to the convention center, you get all of these different products and samples and things like that so I got a bunch I mean literally a bag full of sample products that um, I <laughs> was dying to try when I got home a lot of Shea Moisture, Carol's Daughter, Cream of Nature it was just so much products that um, I had received from going to the festival so I said I'm just gonna go ahead and try it you know while I'm doing my own thing at home um, I've been washing my hair, I've been, you know, trying to style it and things like that. So I'm just going to show you this little style that I have been rocking. It's kind of like a wet scrunch look, kind of like Nicole Murphy type of feel. Um, she gives me life with that hair. Um, she has like this wet scrunch look and it just looks amazing. And um, I really liked the look on me. So I'm going to just show you guys how I achieved that look. And again, I am not going natural. <laughs> I already have most of these products that I have that I'm going to show you um first of all my all in all my echo styler styling gel you guys see me um, post this product in my last video which I thank you guys so much for so much love on my um my top knot bun video that i received a lot of love from i really really appreciate it also the other product that i use is my rapid Rapid Shine Foaming Lotion by Nairobi. I recently tried this particular um, gel. It's by Wetline. It's called Wetline Extreme Professional Extra Hole Styling Gel. And it actually works really, really good for my edges. And you're gonna just need a comb, just a regular old comb, particularly something that's like a medium to wide tooth, um, <laughs> medium to wide tooth comb, similar to this. This one is actually a little bit wider as well. So I kind of use both of these kind of, you know, tag team both of these as well. So anyway, y'all gonna see this hair now and it ain't gonna be cute. <laughs> but anyway, um, this is my hair. And all of this is pretty much still relaxed. And all of this here is pretty much natural. So I'm just gonna go ahead and go and wet my hair. I'm just going to wet it, just dash a bunch of water on it, and I will be right back. I dashed a bunch of water on my hair, so I'm just going to pump a little bit of the Nairobi foaming lotion on it. Take a little bit of the gel, and just kind of rub it in. natural it automatically kind of curls up on the on the roots you can kind of see where it oh I'm pulling my glass up like I'm old lady <laughs> you can kind of see where the root of the hair just kind of curls up 
but then the ends of it is still straight so that's my issue right now and then all I do is basically take my comb and just kind of scrunch it just kind of move the hair forward so it kind of looks like a little scrunch or a wave if that makes any sense and I just do that particularly on the ends like I said again on the ends of the hair because that's where your hair is the most straightest from the relaxer and just kind of form it into you know a nice little cute little c-shape style you may have to play with it every, like I said every texture is different you know you play with it and I kind of found my niche with it so that's why I felt like I needed to do a video for y'all but I've been rocking this style like every day for like four weeks, five weeks. But I'm still ready to get my creamy crack though. <laughs> I'm gonna use the other gel, the wet line gel, and use that for my edges. Because I think this gel has really been working amazing for my edges. It actually works way better than the Echo Stylers, y'all. I, I don't understand why, though. But, hey, you got to listen to your hair. It'll definitely tell you. All right, so I'm going to just take my little edge brush or your old toothbrush, whatever you want to do um, to make those baby edges. Baby edges. Before I actually go out or you know finish this look, I just actually wrap my hair with my wrap cap for a couple minutes. And I literally had the wrap cap on for like three minutes, not long at all. So this is pretty much it, guys. Like I said, I've been rocking this for like four or six weeks and it's been amazing. Um, I will post some pictures or add some pictures in to where the face will speak to the gods and you guys can see the whole look. Um, but anyway, yeah, this is pretty much it. I gave myself a different look um, for a few weeks. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will see you guys in the next video.